Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you're uh, a returning subscriber. Um, welcome if you are just coming on board. So, if you're new to my channel, go back and look at the journal I won from Louise Hines when you'll know where I'm headed with this. Okay, so I made a decision. I'm going to use this book. And it's called, El the name of the book was Elsie's New Relations. It's kind of a maroon, dark maroon, red cover, and it's textured. So I'm going to leave the, mm, I want to leave it as is, but I don't. So I'll probably go ahead and embellish the front. And it's going to be in the style of Louise Heinzel, also grunge, you know, just grungy, grungy, grungy. And then on the backs, um, I'll probably just coffee dye this and use some um, liquid text matte medium and maybe do a little bit of stenciling don't know but it won't be much there's my inside this is some um, factory made homemade paper it's not it's not real handmade paper but I do somewhere have a handmade paper book journal type thing that I'll be using in the journal. It's going to be old. It's going to be vintage. It's going to be mixed media. It's going to be fun. So um, again, I went with packaging and then I was measuring the cover and my pages are going to be seven. Um, uh, real close to seven by I'm going to say four and a half. I think that will do it safely because if it sticks out just a bit, I'm okay. So four and a half. I'm going to get a pencil and mark this because I'm going to make the first one my template. So it'll be four and a half wide by seven. So this is where it's going to be, roughly. And the reason I say roughly is because I'm going to make it grungy, junky. I'm not going to focus too much on whether or not it's even. And you're going to see a lot of different people that I follow when... You see the book. Okay, that I know it's a little crooked. A little bit crooked. Like a little more crooked than I wanted it to be. That I can live with. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to make it with this packing paper. But I'm going to add book pages to each page. Right? So it's going to be something like this. This is the first book page and it'll be centered and I did cut that down so it would fit. So there would be that and then this would go on top. Bingo, boom, first page. Right? So each and every page is going to have something like that on it. And then it's going to have, of course, the lace. It's going to have one of those, but not necessarily the exact same as that. And then see, I'll do some um, stenciling stuff like this. It's going to be very simple. God, I love this paper. But it's going to have a lot of these kind of elements in it. And I'm working my way up, guys. I really, truly am working my way up to be able to do mixed media the way... These ladies do it, but it'll probably take me a kajillion years. But anyhow, that's where we're going. I do have some 1700s, 1784 music book and different things like that that's going to go in here. But I was like, isn't that cool? I mean, that to me says, junk journal. And it's not going to be anything that I'm actually going to journal in. It's going to be something you could just sit down at the coffee table, have a cup of tea, and start drinking. 
you know, have your tea, flip through the pages, and I don't know how many illustrations are in here, but I have lots and lots of cabinet, not lots and lots of cabinet, but I have cabinet cards, and so I'm just going to be, um, is it emulating? Um, shadowing and practicing and showing you what I learned from others and I'm also calling it the copycat collab so if you yeah that's pretty good want to join the open collab and I haven't checked I think nobody's used that um, hashtag it so I'm gonna probably um, look it up and see and hopefully nobody sees it and steals it before I can use it. Okay, but you saw it here first. I'm, um, if I'm the original owner. Okay, that's a little tall. So I'll probably push that up and then, well, because I'll go on the inside of the pages, it should work. I think it should work. Uh, I had my pencil. So that's what all of this is going to happen on, and I've almost near the end of my December dailies and I have two off weeks there I've got a few other a few other actual design team pro um, projects that I'm doing but I really believe that and this one's going to be um, like nothing I'm going to do overnight. This one might take me, I don't know, six months to a year to finish. This one is a for me, for fun. I had to do it, needed to do it, wanted to do it, can't live without journal, right? So let me tear these off. Well, that was weird. That was weird. Okay, so I'll just do it this way. Anyhow, so I'm doing this just for fun. I really am in no rush. And I want to do a lot of cool stuff with it, but I don't want it to be ornate. I just want it to be simple. Fun, enjoyable, and no rush. Like I said, it may take me several months to get this done. How come that was so weird that it didn't tear? For some reason, I didn't want to tear all the way through. So I'll just do it this way. So I'm gonna have fun with it. I'm gonna enjoy it. It is going nowhere, but on my desk. And it's, it's going to be fun. That's what it's going to be. All right, so there we go. And again, I'm okay if the pages aren't even. There we go. Look at all of this for tabs and for ruffles and for stuff. All right, so we'll keep that. There's my first signature, and it'll go in here. And like I said, then I will come in. And I'll glue pages to it. And I don't care if they're even. I don't care if they're uneven. Of course, I won't be using that one, I think. But like this. Look at that. See? Perfect. Perfect. I love it. I think, I think that I got this. I think that I will have fun with this. And I think... It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's see, then this guy will go over here. And it will have that grungy, fun vibe to it. All right? So stay tuned for more of these. And I have one more signature to cut. This one's a little thicker. But I, I really, honest to God, think that this is going to be, like, tons of fun. 
tons and tons and tons of fun. And so I figured so much fun. It might be just fun to bring you guys look at that <laughs> along. Just tear it down this way. Oh, I gotta get this page out because I really liked it. Now I don't want to screw it up. Right? Don't want to mess it up. I think what happened is this set might be a little thicker. All right, there we go. This is cut off. I don't know if I'll keep. Nah, I probably won't keep those. I should, huh? I should, but. So we'll go here. I like it better when they all tear it down. Okay, not bad. Now we have our signatures cut and ready to sew in after I get the book pages. So what I think I'll do, I may go ahead and glue these in and then decorate a, embellish a page and then glue it down. Embellish a page and then glue it down. So it is a little thin. But I think by the time we get through the end of it, it's going to be pretty, pretty thick. All right. There we go. Elsie's, Elsie's grungy journal. Ready to rock and roll. And it does stick out a little bit. It does stick out a little bit. Maybe I could do this. I'll figure it out. I'll get it fixed. I don't want it neat, though. you know. I don't want it fancy. I need it. I need it grungy. I need it a little on the ugly side, right? And again, I'm okay if it's not perfect. Actually, I'm better. We're happier if it's not perfect. All right, let's try it and see. Okay, yeah, I can live with that. I can totally live with that. All right, guys, there we go. We're off and running. Um, again, like I said, what I'm going to do is one page at a time, and it'll be kind of a here and there and like that. Yep, there we go, and I'm going to definitely keep my my, my um, scraps there so thank you for watching thank you for joining me um, and the rest is yet to be seen I do have um, like I said some other um, design team stuff coming up which I really love um, I um, love being a design team uh, member for decorate your life and she just it's just a special thing when you can make a creation of hers, right? Special. It, I, I can't even say anymore. It's like everything she comes out with is grand. And so there you go. That's why I am connected to her and Jenny and all the, the team. Thank you, ladies. You guys are an awesome bunch. I hope to make Louise and 49 Dragonflies and Cara Renee and all the other ladies in the grungy world proud of this. Now I see I have some that are shorter. Oh, I think it's because I haven't cut this piece. I don't know. I don't know. These look shorter now. Like this. That piece looks shorter. Oh, I'm going to make it work. Because if it's too short, then I'm just going to put a, a ruffle. And any which way, nothing special ruffle, just like that. Oh my god, this is going to be so much fun. I have to stop, guys. I will be up till 2 o'clock in the morning working on this. Listen, thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great night.